Hey guys, it's uh, General Heed here, um, and today we're going to be revisiting uh, the weaponless glitch in Halo 3. And this is not just any weaponless glitch, that's easy to do in Forge um, and custom games. This one is going to be done in Campaign. And as far as I know, it can only be done on a mission to Covenant. Um, if you know any other missions you can do this on, uh, do let me know in the comments. But this is all I'm aware of. So what you want to do first is... Um, just stick one of the elites with a plasma grenade. Uh, any one of them will do. And when you stick them, they will pull out an energy sword right before it explodes. And you will want to grab that energy sword. Um, I should also mention, uh, uh, you, you can do this on co-op if you want. Uh, actually, the best results are on co-op. Or, well, I mean, not the best results, the cooler results. Um, but only one person can do it because... Um, uh, aside from the energy sword, you also need one other weapon. You will need the rocket launcher, which only this marine over here in the corner has. And as far as I know, he's the only marine uh, on the on this entire mission up until this point where you can get a rocket launcher. So I don't think there's any other way to get a rocket launcher except for one marine. So because of that, only one person can do this. So yeah, just make sure the um, the person with the energy sword, the person that wants to go weaponless, has both the energy sword and the rocket launcher. And um, just continue on ahead. Um, you don't have to grab a prowler here. I just did just um, just because it's easier to show you um, the weaponless glitch a little bit. And plus, uh, I haven't driven a prowler for like forever, so uh, let alone do the time travel glitch with it. So you know, I figured I'd drive it again just for fun. But like I said, you don't have to do this. Um, what you will need though is uh, either a a flying vehicle or a hover vehicle, like a prowler, like a prowler, the ghost, or banshee or hornet. Um, but banshee or hornet requires a few extra steps. Um, with the ghost or prowler, you can just climb up the mountain over here to do the time travel glitch. So, yeah, all you gotta do here is just climb up and up and all the way to the top. And you want to proceed out into the distance. Now you want to be careful here because if you um, if you don't hit the time travel point correctly, you'll you'll get stuck inside the map at the revert. So what you want to do is just drive up along the edge here. Uh, you'll hit a wall, and then you want to slide along the wall, and just keep sliding along it slowly until you um, hit that little hump, bump there where you like go faster, and then just slowly slide backwards until you load the uh, the other part of the map again. Now you might get stuck sometimes, it just depends on your angle of approach, but yeah. So once you do the time travel glitch, uh, the energy sword and rocket launcher disappears and you will be weaponless. Now I said this uh, has cooler results on co-op because if you're the elite, any elite, not just the arbiter, you do the blue or red elites. Um, when they're weaponless, they they can slide around on the ground, um, and when they melee, they they actually have a melee animation when they're weaponless. And when they throw grenades, their feet just slides around like they're ice skating and stuff. So it's actually a lot cooler with the elites. Um, yeah, but uh, even though they can still melee and you see the melee animation and everything, the melee doesn't do any damage to anybody, so it's kind of useless. But it's just kind of cool that they have that. Now, if you do it by yourself, you can only do it as the Master Chief. So, uh, as a Spartan, uh, if you go weaponless, um, it's actually not that... Not as... I mean, it's still pretty cool to go weaponless, but it's not as uh, cool as the Elites. And let me show you um, exactly what happens. So, it looks like we got stuck again, but, um, just hop out. So, with the Chief, you are weaponless, like before, um, however, uh, you do not slide around when you throw grenades, your, your walking animation is actually perfect, um, and you cannot melee, when you press the melee button, nothing happens, there's no melee animation for weaponless Spartans. Um, I don't know why the elite slide around, I guess it's like an incomplete animation that they didn't account for uh, when they made the game. I guess they weren't expecting people to go weaponless as elites. But, yeah. Um, 
The one interesting thing is that when you throw grenades or like throw equipment, you don't see your arms move or anything from your perspective. Uh, it, they just kind of pop up on your screen and fly out. Uh, I'm pretty sure from other people's perspective, you still do the animations for throwing things. But yeah, uh, you know, it's a pretty simple glitch to do uh, in campaign. It uh, only works on a mission of the Covenant as far as we know. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that. And remember to leave a like uh, if you enjoyed it. And subscribe for more videos. And we'll see you next time.